All right, is that time? It is tie dyeing day? And Miss Stephanie has decided to dye her hands. <laughs> from this morning of mixing this stuff. Oh. Just from this morning. Oh I my god. <laughs> I see a very colorful one over here. I see a bunch of colorful ones over here. I'm putting on my favorite colors. That's awesome. Those are gonna look cool. Oh, I'm seeing a really colorful one down here. Alright, who needs light blue? Yeah, that's yeah I see. Oh, that's cool. Man, that one is, that one's colorful. Oh yeah, that looks cool. He's got blue and orange one. All sorts of colors going on. Seeing lots of cool colors. I'm seeing some cool colors. Um, this is a green bottle blue tarantula. They are from South America. I'm going to bring them around to show you, but um, they have these really cool orange and blue colors. They actually have these uh, like glands called spinnerets on the back of their abdomen, and they make this silk, and they can weave it. Yeah, what's up? Can we pet it? Cannot pet this one. These guys actually have hairs on the back of their abdomen or their butt, and basically they can flick the hairs if they actually get stressed out. Ellie, you were just fine earlier. He can't get out, or she can't get out of there. Okay, let's get this one. Oh, okay. Let's get this one. Oh, okay. We're gonna be our. Asian forest scorpion and our desert hairy scorpion. I'm gonna go around with the Asian forest first and show everybody. These guys are from tropical areas of Asia. They are real, definitely. Uh, this is the second largest uh, type of scorpion in the world. The, the biggest is the emperor. All right, so this next one is one of the largest cockroaches in the world. These are Madagascar hissing cockroaches. They are from the island of Madagascar, which is an island off the coast of Africa. This is haagen I believe. That's the name. We have Ben and & Jerry and haagen the ice cream. But the little one is the one that really makes the noise. But you can feel too, these guys are actually have a really like bony, like hard shell. And that's that exoskeleton too, just like the other bugs. So you can go home and be like, look what I held at camp. That's a very well behaved one. So people also think roaches are very dirty animals, but in reality, um, most species, um, like the tropical ones, are all very clean. Um, they eat all kinds of decomposing stuff and things like that. It will bite you. Oh, good job, Noah. That is cute. I 
What do you want? So hold it. It's pretty crazy, huh? You look so big in her hands. <laughs> because they have an instinct to just chomp down. So I'm gonna give, them some, give her some roaches here. We'll see if she goes for it. Yeah, she's not the... She's not the most agile. <laughs> oh, she got it. <laughs> Ready on this side? Yeah. Oh. Big circles on her ears, they're called tympanic membranes, and that's how they most frogs hear. See that little circle right above my thumb? She's being really good. Gray spot? Mm -hmm. That's her. It's not as exaggerated as like an American bullfrog. They're very pretty short. 